Hey, it's Lizzie Armanto, and today we're at Garbanza Skate Park, and today you're going to be learning 5-0 rolling. To do this trick, you're probably going to want to know how to drop in. You're going to want to know how to 5 0 grind backside or frontside, depending on whichever way you want to approach the coping. And you're going to want to know how to roll in like anywhere that you're trying it. So, starting off, you're going to want to have a moderate amount of speed, and you're going to be hopefully going parallel with the coping and then you're just aiming for like one part of it and that's going to be your start off point for like when your tr your truck's going to hit the coping and then from then on you're going to want to start leaning in until you are fully locked onto the coping in a 5-0 and then just ride it out until you decide to go back in. Personally, I like locking in like this because that way my back wheels like on the coping and you have your like front, your, most of your weight's on your back foot and so you just like kind of roll with it until you want to go in and when you want to go in you just put your weight on your toes and roll away like you would any 5-0. Definitely want to make sure that whatever you're trying it on you're like comfortable with the like part and you want to work your way up to something bigger and like not start off to somewhere that's like way over your ability because that's I don't know unless you're just gonna hail Mary and just go for it but usually it doesn't work out so to do the 5-0 rolling you're gonna want to learn how to do 5-0 grinds front side 5-0 grinds and roll-ins in general and hopefully where you're at there's going to be decent coping. It's easiest to do it on pool coping because it'll give you some resistance whereas metal coping it kind of just slides and I don't know it's, it takes a little bit more skill but I don't know it always like sounds cooler when you do it on pool coping anyway. So to do a 5-0 roll and you're probably going to want to learn it, learn how to do it on a round wall or it's like it's possible to do it on a flat wall but it's not as easy because the with the round wall the curve you start to lean in and it'll like keep your momentum and like your weight in the bowl and it's like easier to figure it out. So I'm Lizzie Armanto and that's how you do 5-0 roll-ins. Three minutes. Here we go. Off just on your toes, so that way when you flip, the back foot just kind of gets out of the